Hi guys, Sammy here from Clove and boy do we have an exciting device to show you today. If you're ready to view the death of the notch first hand then you're definitely in the right place as we have a look at Honor's latest device, the Honor View 20. Now Honor have become renowned for providing exceptional value for money and with some stunning photography capabilities and a striking design this can only be considered a flagship product. The Honor View 20 is now shipping from Clove with either 128GB or 256GB of internal storage in Phantom Blue, Midnight Black and Sapphire Blue. So head on over to our website to check that one out. So what exactly do you get for your money? Let's have a closer look. Honor have become synonymous with providing some really striking devices and as you can see here the Honor View 20 is certainly no different. Now there's clearly one thing that we have to discuss first and that's this in-screen O-shaped front camera cutout in the top corner. Honor have achieved this really effectively by making part of the display transparent, enabling the hole to be as small as possible. Indeed, Honor's engineers have reassured us that a particular glue dispersion tech has been used to affix the camera to the display, which makes it possible to repair a broken screen without needing a new front camera. The obvious benefit to this is the sheer amount of display that this lends the device. Notches have been the topic of much debate and we know that many of you hate them, but their benefits are clear. But what the in-screen cutout does is blow this out the water by providing a tiny 4.5mm hole that gives more display for a better design and overall a cleaner look. In fact, the Honor View 20 comes with a massive 91.8% screen to body ratio that barely interferes with full screen games in landscape and we've really, really enjoyed it. The screen itself is an impressive 6.4 inch Full HD LCD display which coupled with a 1080 by 2310 pixel resolution provides some really bright and vivid colours. If that wasn't enough then the rear of the device is equally as striking and is one of our favourite designs in the last few months. The back cover is absolutely dazzling and comes with a unique chevron like pattern. As you might be able to see here the trademark V shape becomes visible when light shines on it from different angles. The 8.1mm aluminium frame makes the handset feel very rigid and premium which complements the curved sides very well to make it incredibly easy to use the device one handed. The fingerprint scanner to the rear has also been quick and responsive for us and the device comes in midnight black, phantom blue and sapphire blue. As a sub-brand of Huawei, you may be expecting a lot of the camera setup of the Honor View 20, and good news, you're not wrong. Indeed, the Honor View 20 is the first device to be fitted with an ultra-high quality 48 megapixel rear camera that's a Sony IMX586 CMOS sensor with a fast f1.8 aperture. This combines with the device's Kirin 980 processor to offer impressive multi-frame image processing. Now rather than featuring a secondary lens, the Honor View 20 instead has a 3D time of flight sensor that's utilised solely to detect depth. This makes it possible to manipulate certain parts of your image separately to make instant adjustments and is really effective when applied to things like blurred background in portrait mode. The AI tech of the device is also very impressive and can recognise multiple scenes at the same time, for example greenery, buildings and blue sky all at once. AI Ultra Clarity Mode also works to create an AI enabled high definition 48 megapixel image by taking multiple 48 megapixel shots and combining them for greater clarity. If selfies are more your thing, then the Honor View 20 comes with an impressive 25 meg megapixel front camera with an f2.0 aperture that can be adjusted with professional type lighting or by applying AR filters. The standard AI features for bokeh and beauty are installed and we've been very impressed with the results. Take a look at some of the images we've shot for yourself. Now, the Honor View 20 comes with the same high silicon Kirin 980 octa-core processor that's fitted in the Mate 20 Pro. So what's new? Well, the Honor View 20 incorporates a feature called Link Turbo, which combines 4G and Wi-Fi capabilities for faster downloads. The device then decides automatically which technology should be used, taking latency into account. But unfortunately, we haven't had too much time to test this out for ourselves. Alongside this, Honor have created a new liquid cooling system that combines both hardware and software for improved thermal performance. An ultra-thin heat tube draws heat away from the SOC, camera, battery and charging chip and into a multi-layered heat spreader made of composite materials. 
The large 4,000 milliamp battery will get you through a day and possibly even two without any problems and comes with support for 22.5 watt supercharge via USB-C to get you back up and running in absolutely no time. Now, unfortunately, there's no micro SD slot or, or an IP rating, but the Honorview 20 does come fitted with that trusty headphone jack. So as you can see, the Honorview 20 comes fitted with a host of features that are usually reserved for more expensive devices. In my personal opinion, the overall look of the device is currently unparalleled. The cutout on the front looks exceptional and allows for such a large and full display, whilst the rear finish is really unique and personally I really love it. We've been really impressed with the camera software that comes fitted and the internals are also really quick and efficient. You're really going to struggle to find a better device currently on the market at this price point. The Honorview 20 is now available from Clove with 128 gigs of internal memory and 6 gigabytes of RAM in midnight black or sapphire blue for £499. Alternatively, the 256 gig variant with 8 gigabytes of RAM is available in phantom blue for £599. Make sure you head to our social media channels and subscribe to our channel for all of the latest news and information. Thank you all for watching and we'll catch you next time.